I'm not at my apartment. I am standing on top of 145 Central Park North, literally right on the border of Central Park. Let me, let me just show you. This view is amazing. Good morning, New York City. It is a beautiful sunny day. Today you can expect a high of 92 degrees and clear skies. But right now you are listening to Dreamboat by Chase Maverick. So lost, stuck in my head. Don't know where to next. I feel so lost. It's hard to test back. So much metal my chest. I feel so lost. Stuck in my head. Don't know where to next. I feel so lost. It's hard to test back. So much metal my chest. I don't know about you guys, but that is a good coffee. Literally $9 a month. Anywhere in the city, three coffees is $9. And you get unlimited coffee every two hours. No brainer. Every day. Every day. Why not? I'm in my element. Money getting bigger, that's the evidence. They wanna see me fall, I promise you I never slip. So today is a shoot day, which means that I have a lot of pre-production work to do. My morning routine is pretty similar every day. I go and get my coffee, and then I come and sit in a park, and I usually journal and do my to-do list in a notebook. Anything you want on this dish. Uh, this grip love to get rich. I was finding myself feeling very unproductive, and especially when I have a day filled with a lot of things, it's easy to feel like I'm just doing so much at one time and feeling like I didn't get anything done at all. So I started doing a to-do list so that I can reflect on it at the end of my day and I can look back and see all the things that I got done. And I find it to be a really good self-reflection habit. Little lady wanna drop off the top. Didn't really know it, but she fresh off the block. Let her let you know a couple things about love. Little lady wanna drop off the top. Didn't really know it, but she fresh off the block. We are at 393, which is a studio in downtown Manhattan. It's owned by my friend Doton. I'm here with Manoa though, because he's DPing for this music video today. This is Manoa. Manoa is a cameraman, photographer, videographer, cinematographer, filmmaker, editor, editor teacher, teacher. I have a lot of things. Uh, Manoa does, Manoa does a lot. Manoa is helping me with the lighting setup today. We have an Ari light panel. We have an aperture 120D and then another key light over here if we need it. This space is super unique because on each wall, there is a certain and specific projector so we've created a visual that's gonna be projected on all of the walls, like a 360, so that when the artists are performing, they're performing in the middle of the room here, and then all of the walls around them are gonna be the video that we've created. I spent a lot of time in the past week going around the city filming and then putting that visual together. It's supposed to look old and vintage and give you like a real nostalgic vibe when you're watching it. And then in the music video, we actually cut two footage shot on the VHS camera. So you have it projected on the walls, but then it's also gonna be shot on the VHS camera for, for part of it. Most of it will be shot on a Sony that Manoa will be working. Uh, how confident are you? Oh, I'm 100% confident. I'm, I'm really confident in you too, bro, oh, or else I wouldn't you, hire you. I appreciate it. No, I'm super excited for this, especially to work on more music videos. Like, when you hit me up about this, I was like, hell yeah, let's go. Girl, I'm trying to keep you for of me, yeah, yeah. Lock you for myself so you can go nowhere. Need you for my help, that's why I need you there. Yeah, uh, yeah, for the call you there. So me and Manoa have known each other for quite a while now. My like unofficial slogan has just become I want to create cool shit with my friends and being able to work with Manoa, being one of my friends, is just a dream come true. Oh, thank you, man. Put it there, bro. Heck yeah. Brass knuckles. I, I hate it every time. I feel like my hand is going to break. Can you tell me a little bit about what it's like to be a freelance DP, camera operator in New York City? Uh, it's a lot of fun. I mean, like, you just... I just got hit up to do this video a few days ago. I've had people hit me up to do shoots the next day. So you, you never really know what's going to happen. So it makes everything super interesting. Cleared out the space. We just have our gear we have to bring back. But that's a shoot day. It's, it's going on five o'clock now and uh, we shot for four hours and it's a wrap. Killing me, killing me, killing me, killing me, killing me, so. 
That shoot today went super well. We just wrapped up a few minutes ago. We're waiting to return some of this gear right now. Overall, super happy with how today went. The shoot was super smooth. It was great to have Manoa on set to shoot. As part of my goal as a freelancer, as a creative, is I'm really trying to focus on directing. So the more jobs that I can direct, the more practice I have. And when I'm able to hire friends like that for a music video or literally any type of shoot, it allows me to focus on the directing aspect, which is what ultimately I wanna be doing. There's really no better place to do that than in New York City. In my opinion, like once I moved from Connecticut to here, I had so many more opportunities to grow, to expand my business, to have more jobs, to grow my network. All of those things are super valuable and allow me to do this every day. They wonder how I've been, I tell them I'm fine. Feeling myself, I'm doing it right this time. Yeah. Never get rest, I'm staying up late on night. <laughs> little overdone there. Little overdone. <laughs> you ain't gotta worry about me, just know I'll yeah. be alright. Life isn't perfect, but I make it work. Think about the hey boy. What's up? What's up, Oscar? I'm also dog sitting right now. I wish Oscar was my dog. Not part of my life as a freelancer, but just a perk. We just got home, had tacos. Julia made amazing tacos for dinner. They were, they were really good. Days like today are honestly my favorite. I just get to work with my friends, create art that I love, and then execute on it. This year has been my first time building a team of any kind for my business, and it is incredible. I hired an editor for the first time, which has honestly been the best choice I've made for my business personally. I get to go and focus on other things, like shoot this music video today. If I didn't have my editor, I would not have been able to take the job I did today and I would literally be sat at my chair, at my desk, in my room editing. I realized that I don't wanna pass up opportunities when there is a solution to that, and that's expanding my team and really creating the business and business model that I want to have for myself, which is going into the directing path and, and putting those other people in place to help expand and grow. All right, well, that's it for uh, this vlog today. It's Friday night, it's 8, 10 p.m. I'm gonna have a glass of wine. What about, what about you? Just a few. Just a few? Mm -hmm. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice now. I got the juice. I got the juice now. I got the juice now.